Right now, the Broadway Street home is destroyed and three bystanders are behind bars. All of this happening in just the last few hours. Dayton firefighters are met with a burst of flames on the front porch of this Broadway Street home. Officials tell us that's what they call a flashover and say they can be extremely dangerous. Luckily, no one was hurt in the big blaze. Well, I went down the side of the walk there and everything was just in flames. With the exception of furniture, we're told the home was empty. So at this time, fire officials aren't sure if anyone lives there or not. But you may remember this home was a scene of a double homicide back on St. Patrick's Day. So far, it's unclear if that had anything to do with Tuesday's fire. The crews say they will be investigating. Uh, at this time, the uh, investigators were, were doing their investigation, and um, they're still determining the cause right now. But no obvious like, No obvious reasons, yeah. Although the electric was off to the building. And while crews were battling the flames, Dayton police arrested three bystanders who they say were intoxicated and not listening to officers' orders to back up. All three were taken to the Montgomery County Jail and charged with misconduct at an emergency. Officials say one of them will also be charged with disorderly conduct and resisting arrest. He was tased at the scene. Use of force at this point is uh, considered appropriate for the situation. Uh, the male was extremely resisting, disorderly, and the officers acted appropriately by uh, overcoming that resistance and obtaining his cooperation. Now, right now, all three men remain locked up at the Montgomery County Jail, and the fire is still under investigation. We'll keep you posted on any new developments in either, in either case. Reporting live downtown, Megan O'Rourke, 2 News on your side.